Welcome everyone to another episode of The Musician's Gear. In today's episode, we're going to be talking about the XR18 by Behringer. But first, in celebration of my 10th episode of The Musician's Gear, I'm going to be doing a $10 giveaway to a random subscriber of mine. To enter the giveaway for a chance to win $10, you must do three things. Number one, be a subscriber of this channel. Number two, like this video. And number three, comment down below why you should win this $10 giveaway. Do these three things and I'll announce the winner one week from when this video is released. Also, I hope everyone had a fantastic Halloween. For me, it was nice to just spend time with family and loved ones and just really enjoy their company. Now moving on to the XR18. The XR18 has 16 channels with XLR and quarter inch inputs. It also has two more inputs that are just quarter inch for a total of 18 channels. The preamps in this mixer are powered by Midas. The XR18 is a smaller digital mixer that can be controlled with either an iPad or a computer. Designed with mobility in mind, the XR18 has a built-in Wi-Fi router, so you don't need an external router to be able to connect to it with an iPad. The XR18 gives you the freedom to focus on your mix while allowing you to move about the venue to experience every part of it that the audience is hearing. Plus, you can adjust live monitor wedges from the artist's perspective. Or better yet, let them mix their own IMEs and floor monitors via their own tablets. Because of its size, this mixer takes up very little space on stage and is very easy to transport. This mixer can be great for quick setups and small events. If I'm running an event by myself, I really like this mixer because I can be on the go running around and have an iPad and be mixing at the same time. This can be extremely helpful. My only problem with this mixer is that the antenna can break really easily and the built-in router isn't always the best. Although nine out of 10 times, it really works great. Although another thing that would be really nice is if you had the ability to use this mixer as a digital snake for Behringer digital boards. Overall, I'd probably rate this mixer as a solid 8.8 .8 out of 10. If it could be used as a digital snake and had a better antenna, then it most likely would be a 10 out of 10. This mixer costs about $600 and has a case that comes with it. If you need to be mobile and only need 18 channels with a handful of monitor mixes, then I would recommend the XR18. Let me know what you would use this mixture for in the comments down below. Also, why you should win the $10 giveaway. Well, that's all for now. Make sure to check back to see if you're the winner of this video. As always, guys, I'll see you in the next one.